All right, questions for Carson? Start with Bob Tron. Thanks, Brandon. Hi, Carson. Hello. Uh, hi, hey, Carson. Uh, I've asked you on more than one occasion about your uh, you being a shooter, and each time I've asked you, you've deter you've been determined to say that your focus is on playing the whole game as a all aspects of the game. Where did that come from, and how has that helped you? Get to where you are now i mean you're playing very well oh uh thank you and uh i just want to continue to work with them try to be consistent whatever opportunity i get just try to be the best i can with it but uh i just think making a making a, an approach to the game and just trying to play the right way and do the right things man i feel like because uh you can always control some shots not gonna go in some shots are some nights you have good nights sometimes you won't but you can always control how hard you play things you can control like your assignments and stuff like that i feel like that's where you should start but then also i feel like those are ways to get yourself in rhythm and then everything else will kind of fall into place so that's just kind of why i approach everything that way gary washburn hey, carson was there one moment um that you felt like just more comfortable on the floor has it been gradual because it just seems like you're just flowing better you, you reading things better. It just seems like the whole thing is like the game is slowing down, as people say, happens when you're young, when you're, you know, rookie or second year. Um, I mean, I mean, I'm still just working and I'm still trying to improve and be consistent. But I mean, I feel like anyone can say that just with, along with um, just kind of seeing be going through it and just kind of playing and eventually, I guess, to slow down. But for me, I still just believe that it's still a lot of room for, for improvement for me. So end of the day, I'm not going to say the game's completely slowed down, but I just think it's just, just seeing stuff where you can grow, continue to try to find ways to improve. So. Go ahead, Hector. Hey, Carson, uh, out of San Antonio, uh, how much have you had a chance to, to look at this year's Spurs team? And I ask because it, it's different from the traditional Spurs teams. We've known for years, you know, they got a lot of youth, uh, relative inexperience. So just wondering how much you've had a chance to kind of, I know you're busy, doing, you, you're, you're busy, but how much you've had a chance to, to watch them or whether it's film live, et cetera, et cetera. Well, I mean, I'm trying to keep up with it. I know you play, you're playing a lot of games and stuff and stuff, but I know that they're, they have some young guys on the wings, but they're very athletic. They play very well. And I mean, every Spurs team is going to be good and play hard and play the right way. So as far as I know, I'm seeing from film, they have they're a really good team and they play well together and they have really athletic guards and wings. So, Abby. Hey, Carson. Um, I'm just wondering, and because we haven't gotten a chance to speak to you, uh, the experience you had with the coronavirus, did you test positive and did you have any symptoms and just how are you feeling now? Whatever you're allowed to talk about. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what I'm about to talk about, but uh, do you mind if say whatever? But uh, yeah, I mean, I yeah, I, I did, I did test positive, and um, I had symptoms for a couple of days, but then after that, I was kind of just there. I lost my taste, my and my smell, and then kind of after that, I was just kind of on quarantine for because it was the first two nights were rough, but then after that, I was just kind of on quarantine, just just trying to stay out the way and be healthy and get healthy. So I'm fine now, and I feel better. So. All right, we're going to wrap it up right there. Thanks, Carson. All right, thank you.